Honorable Dr. A.P.J. Kalam, Honorable Chief Minister of Panya Pades, Mr. Chan Prabhu Naidu, Honorable Ministers of Panya Pades, Government officials, state universities, my former friends and media, good afternoon, namaskara. Bharat Maji Rashtrapati, Gaurav Niru Dr. Abhul Kayam Garu, Andhra Pradesh Rashtra Mukhya Mandri, Gaurav Niru Sri Nara Chandrabhav Naidu Garu, Rashtra Mandri, Prabhu Kwadi Karlu, Rashtra Vishwa Vidyalayala Pradhanathuru, Raitu Sodarlu, Patrika Madhumala Varaki, Namaskara. We are inspired with the presence of His Excellency Dr. Kalam, who has put the country and the world now through his scientific leadership in the areas of defense as well as foreseeable use, and his visionary leadership when he was president of this country, igniting the young minds of this beloved country. So Mr. Naido is famous for his dynamic and much foresighted leadership which had put the Hyderabad on the world map for IT-led development in the undivided under. This vision for sustainable development is well evident from the various programs like Miru Miru and now he is powering the newly created state of Andhapades to become one top performing state in the country in agriculture by 2022 under the Suarandra vision on the occasion of celebrating 75 years of independence. Pleased to be here on the occasion of launching one of the seven missions, particularly primary sector mission, for fulfilling the Swarnandra vision 2029 and also happy to be associated with the primary sector mission as it deals with the small farm holders livelihood improvement. As a son of a small farmer in the Philippines, I am much aware with the difficulties of farming communities in developing countries and later got better appreciation of the need to devise policies and programs to benefit the farmers as then Minister of Agriculture in the Philippines. I have served this country and other 55 developing countries of Asia and Africa for devising and developing science-led innovations to improve livelihoods of farmers through increasing productivity, profitability, sustainability, and prosperity. The ASTAS as an international institute working in India to help the state in devising a strategy for transforming the primary sector in Andhra Pradesh with a aim to make the state the top performing state in the country by 2022 and we really agreed to do the job as farmers' welfare is very close to our heart as it's a shared vision with government. Given today, the hard-working officers in the state who tirelessly work with the Kisat team to prepare the strategy paper lent by Dr. Swaswani. Mr. Chief Minister, the state of Andhra Pradesh is fortunate to have dedicated cadre of officers with you in different capacities such as planning, agriculture, fisheries, and animal husbandry in devising a good strategy for the primary sector mission. Goal of Honorable Chief Minister Garu for this mission is very noble and achievable as it converges on the sectors of primary sector and more because of the hardworking, industrious and progressive farmers in the state along with fertile soils and available water resources. This mission is a unique one converging science 
development in political will, an injection of much needed capital resources. What it calls is concerted efforts and investments in building the needed infrastructure for the private sector and in the end uplifting the livelihoods and income of smallholder farmers in the state. Mana to the shared vision of the state for making farmers productive, prosperous, resilient, and profitable. We need other witnesses to the people and the government of Andhra Pradesh, Namaskaram, and Danya Wadalu.